Birzd Tiltomad on Almanawi. Esquetu. Hello. I'm sorry, but I do not speak your language. Really? Then you are a Renaigze. I have never met one with the bond. Might I do something for you? I am looking to find Vinbar, the High King of Tirfredi, and I was told that he was born in this village. He disappeared after visiting the heart of the island, but I was hoping someone here might know where he's hiding. You should speak with Sarah. She is the companion of our king. Where might I find her? I do not know. She left the village, and I have not seen her in several days. Anything else? What can you tell me about your village? Wenshavar means the water of the peaks in our language. The sky is our roof, the mountain our cradle, and the birds our companions. They offer us their feathers that we weave with wool to make clothing that is appreciated by the Donegada. And also, of course, it is the village that has given birth to the one chosen for our Hoi King for many cycles. Anything else? What can you tell me about the High King? You must know him well. He is a great Donigad. Wise, just, and through him, the En On Mil Frictimen makes their voice be known. But he has been gone for several moons. And I, for one, believe that the mountain has taken him back. Anything else? What can you tell he, me? An, anything. Tell me about Sarah. She is a ferocious warrior. And like I told you, she is the Menundanem, the companion of the Hoi King. They gave themselves one to the other many cycles ago. And their bond is very strong. Perhaps that is why she has left. Because she no longer could bear his absence. Anything else? Goodbye. What hour am saying? It is rare to see Renaixe here. Is there something I can do for you? I'm looking for High King Vinbar. I know that he disappeared after having visited the heart of the island. But someone here in this village might know where he went after that. If anyone knows, it would be Sarah. But you will not find her here. Anything else? Would you know where I could find Sarah? She left to follow Vimbor. She wanted the mountains to take her as well. What do you mean? We don't know if Renaixe could understand. Our High King is on Olmenawi, and a Donegad. His bond with the mountain is very strong. Even stronger now that he speaks with the En Olmil Frichtimen. He is becoming a Nadaig. It is the fate of the wisest among us. Seda knew that the mountain would take him back. And she wanted the mountain to take her as well. She went to attempt to bond herself to it. She sought the cavern of knowledge. We haven't seen her since. She might have succeeded. Anything else? Where is this cavern of knowledge located? We don't know. The caverns of knowledge are the concern of the Donegada. Anything else? What can you tell me about your village? Wenshevar is a place of peace and meditation. The troubles with the Renaixe are far from here. We weave feathers and we do not interfere with the problems on the plains. It seems strange that one of your own became High King. 
It was because of his wisdom that he was chosen. In a time where those from the faraway islands were not yet here. Anything else? You must know the High King Vinbar. What can you tell me about him? He was one of the greatest Donegada. Wise amongst the wise. But the arrival of the Renaixe troubled him. He was afraid that you would be like the people of the sea. He traveled the island far and wide, saw the other kings and queens, and consulted the other Donegada. And then he spent more and more time speaking with En on Milfrichtimen. He moved away from us until we hardly saw him at all. Anything else? You seem to be close to Sarah. Could you tell me about her? She is my friend. She is a great warrior. One of the village's greatest protectors. But her love for Vimbar is stronger than our friendship. And stronger than her duties to the village. I am afraid for her, Renaixe. Afraid of what she might do in order not to lose him. Because she is untamable. And when she makes her mind about something, she does not change it. Anything else? Thank you for your help. Where Aulam said. But I do something for you. I heard talk about a cavern of knowledge. It is a place where the Donegada go. Within the earth, they hear the voices of those that went before them. And they learn. There are some on Tiafradi. The closest to our village is found to the northeast of here. But the entrance is sealed, hidden. It is a sacred place. A place for only the Donegada. Anything else? Goodbye. What I want to say.
Huh! <laughs> 
about to get dicey. is in our hands. It is time to tell us all you know. The sooner you speak, the sooner this will be over with. Wouldn't I She's been enduring this punishment for hours, blow upon blow through gritted teeth. Truly savage beast we have here. Do we even know if it speaks our language? Leave us. You will eventually tell us how you found your way into that grotto. Your defiance is only prolonging the inevitable. You remind me of that rat my master was studying. The creature used all of its fire in an effort to escape. Scratching, twisting, refusing to understand that the cage holding it was its only remaining world. It had everything it could ever need, but it wouldn't stop looking for a way out. Even though its fate was now sealed to serve science, its animal instinct drove it to flee. It had strangled itself between the bars of its own cage in a final futile attempt to escape. It was an enormous beast and very clever. If it had simply relented, it could have lived peacefully for many years. Instead of that... <coughs> <coughs> These monsters are torturing her. Come, we must set her free. I recognize this face. Lord Dasade. what a pleasure to see you again. What good wind brings you? These people are monsters. They just tortured a woman, and then they say hello as if it were nothing. I'm sure that they will explain what pushes them to treat her this way. Believe me, we would never have reached such extremities if she had told us what we wanted. You see, we have been studying these beings that show, like you, such strange markings on their bodies. We call them metamorphs, but the natives call them Onolmanawi. 
And we seek to learn through what process they metamorphosize. We heard talk of a cavern of knowledge. The savages hide all of their knowledge within them. And certainly all the secrets that interest us. We discovered one here, but are unable to enter. This woman, she knows how to enter. But as you have witnessed, she refuses to tell us how. To know we are so close to understanding such a fascinating phenomenon. And to be able to do nothing. Let's just say it has made us aggressive. It's extremely regrettable. Free her. We would like to have a word with her. She won't tell you anything. Let us handle this. She will give in at some point. Lord de Sade has a soft spot for the savages. But he understands the price of knowledge. As proof, he spared my life during our last encounter. Without my intervention, the coin guard would have taken control of the entire island. One word from me to Governor Burren will have you rotting in his jails. Free her. Unless your love of science requires greater sacrifice. Your governor resides too far from here to be a threat, Desade. Forget it. Since you have chosen to act like monsters, it's like monsters we shall treat you. Ha! I shall finally get my revenge. <laughs> How are you feeling? Better now. Those Renaixe are absolute monsters. But who are you? You too are a Renaixe. Why have you freed me? We were told at Wen Shavar that you and you alone could tell us where to find High King Vinbar. I wish I knew where he was right now. He bid me farewell weeks ago and he has not returned. I waited a long time and then I came here to enter into the Cavern of Knowledge. You believe this is where he's hiding? No. But he came here often before he disappeared. I'm hoping to find answers. You save me. And so I must help you as well. You may come with me. Let's try to escape without bloodshed. We must get you to a safe place.
Here is the entrance to the Cavern of Knowledge. I hope that Vinbar has left a clue to where he went. Something I could track. Is it your wish to join him? He is my Manundanem. That means the one who shares my mind in your language. We must be reunited. I understand. But why protect the entrance to the cavern at the risk of your own life? The caverns of knowledge are truly sacred places. Only the Donegada have the right to enter. But you're not a Donegad. Is that right? I am not. But I must enter in spite of everything. And since you have helped me, you may enter as well. Since you punished those other Renaikse, I believe you deserve it. Remind yourself that this honor is immense and show respect. I implore you. Put your fears to rest. We have not come to defile this sacred place. How do we enter? Allow me. I have seen Vinbar make these movements so many times. This fresco is still fresh. It must have been painted recently. It's of a crowned man. Vinbar, no doubt. It looks as if he's walking through the skies towards the volcano. A face has been painted on the volcano. The spirit of the mountain. My heart did not betray me. Vinbar has readied himself to join Enon Milfrichtemen. Was that why you came in here? To confirm that supposition? To understand, yes. As the years passed, my Minundanem grew more and more distant to me. I thought at first it was due to his status and the invasion of the Renaikse. But now I see that he was hearing the call of Enon Milfrichtemen. He had no choice but to answer it. Oh, Vinbar, why did you not share this with me? These paintings are older. This looks like it represents a man who transforms himself into some kind of enormous bird. He is a Danegad, becoming a Nadaig Manaman. Vinba was also bound to the mountain. It is no doubt the path he has chosen to follow. If I understand correctly, the Danegada metamorph differently according to the place they are bound. Yes. The Sinol Minawi bind them to a specific place, and in return they become the Guardians. But how could a Guardian of the Plains resemble a Guardian of the Mountains? Do you believe that Vinbar is readying himself to undergo this transformation? I thought it was a very slow process. For some, it takes years. At least this is what is said. For others, it might take place the very moment where the Donegad surrenders to Enol Milfrichtemen. I hope only to have the time to bid him farewell. Given how well hidden this seed was, it must open an important passage. All we have to do is find out which. This mural is also ancient. It seems to show a doorway into the mountain. This door appears to be in front of a circle of stone. There are two altars and two seeds. 
The Donegada seal certain sacred places with the root doors. Yes, I've run into similar barriers. It's all a matter of finding the right seed. But here, there are two that seem to be different. For one, the flower motifs seem to indicate which plant is required. This is possible. The caverns of knowledge are used to initiate and transmit the knowledge of the Danae Gada. This painting must teach the younger how to reach the sacred place where they will bind themselves. In that case, shouldn't there be an illustration of the second plant? The initiates also learn by listening to their masters. In this one, we see a sacred site with raised stones, and behind the face of the volcano, we also see the path that leads there, like some sort of schematic. This must certainly be the path the young apprentices must walk, and the Done Gada that are prepared to surrender themselves to Enon Mil Frichtime. Do you recognize the place where the entrance can be found? I think so. It looks like the grotto that lies to the northwest of our village. With all that we've learned from studying these paintings, we should be able to find Vinbar. I just hope there's still enough of him left to answer us. And that Constantine is with him. And that he is still alive. Who is Constantine? I thought you were looking for Vinbar. I seek them both. I had hoped that Vinbar would help me enter the sanctuary of Dorhad Genedu. But I learned from the Tierna Hach Kadaktus that he took my cousin. The Tierna told you this? And so you seek to avenge him? No. Only to save my cousin and try to understand why. None of what you say makes sense. Why would Vinbar take your cousin? I... I don't understand. I... My head spins. I need to breathe fresh air. I shall await you outside. Please, go ahead. We will join you soon. I have a feeling we shouldn't have let this woman leave on her own. Shara is upset, and I don't think that she trusts us. We should hurry and catch up to her. I shouldn't have told her about Constantine. She must have thought we wanted to kill her husband. This door is locked. Sarah has put us in a very tricky situation. She did not want us to find Vinbar. Come, these caves often have several exits.
Those traps weren't here when we went through with Sarah earlier. She must have set them to make sure that we wouldn't be able to follow her. Let's hurry and find this passage to the northern mountain before she decides to come and fight us directly. have been slaughtered. It must have been Sarah taking her revenge. It's unlikely that she acted alone. We should stay alert. This is the place which was depicted on the mural in the Cave of Knowledge. Vimbar must have hidden the passage to the sanctuary.
Finally, we've made it to high ground. Now, let's find this trail to the sanctuary. It can't be far from here. Bloodied feathers. I wouldn't like to meet the bird they belong to. Looks like Vinbar must have begun his transformation. He will soon become a guardian of the mountains. If we want to have any chance of saving Constantine, we must hurry. More of these giant feathers. We're on the right trail. You should not have come all this way, Renaixe. I will not let you near Vimbar. Sarah, we must see him. We don't have a choice. We saved you. Why have you locked us in the cavern? And why do you now stop us from passing? I thought at first that you were different than the others. I thought it my duty to help you. But I learned looking at the paintings that this was madness. Vimbar has heard the calling and answered. Even if it breaks my heart, he has done what is right. He maintains the balance. No one must stop him. I am his Minundanem. It is now my duty to defend the path he treads. His path led him to kill Katasach, and now he holds my cousin captive. I'm sorry, Sarah, but no one will keep us from passing. Eight more! Over there, more feathers. More of these giant feathers. We're on the right trail. We found the entrance to the sanctuary. Vinbar must be here, with Constantine. If he's still alive, we need to find a way to get inside quickly. This must be the entrance to Vinbar's sanctuary. But it's obstructed. He knows how to protect his home. A stone altar. It resembles the one that protects the passage to Mev's sanctuary. This must be where I need to place the seed. And here is another altar. Two seeds necessary to open the passage. The seed that Sarah was carrying should work. To think that she gave her life to protect the one she loved. Now that we have both seeds, the ritual should work. <laughs> 